are today we are going to create this casting component this is a solid component and all the dimension are in mm and this is a third angle projection first angle projection method so let's start from the sketcher और आप लोगों से मैं कहना चाहूँगा अगर आप लोगों ने अभी तक हमारे चैनल को सब्सक्राइब नहीं किया है तो प्लीज़ सब्सक्राइब कर लीजिए और यहाँ पे स्टार्ट करते हैं हम इस मिडिल वाले पोर्शन से तो सबसे पहले आप समझ लीजिए इसे बनाना कैसे है आई विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द दिस मिडिल पोर्शन एंड द सर्किल टू सर्किल आर दियर वन इज थर्टी टू का मीटर एंड अनदर इज इज मिलीमीटर रेडियस एंड एक्सटूड इट नाइन्टी एंड देन Start from the front plane and draw the shape. I will draw the shape, and uh, including this rib. This is a rib, right? Uh, it is not visible properly, but if you will, um, uh, see, this is a taper. Right? So I will draw this from the middle portion, and at the last, I will draw this portion and extrude it to the seventy. So start with the center. And the diameter is 32. First, for the first and second is 17. With the same center. Now finish it. And now select the extrude and reverse the direction. And the depth is 95 millimeter. And click OK. So our first step is complete. Now we will draw this one. So select the sketch and select the middle plane and orient the plane. So what we are going to what we are going to do? We will draw this portion. So start. We will start from here, and it is something like this. It should not middle now. Yeah, okay. It's properly. I uh, click. It is near about thirty, and then. Go to upside, and then in front, and then click, and and close this one. Ha! Huh. This is our shape. Now I'm I will dimension it. This is thirty millimeter, and forty five plus fifteen. Forty-five plus fifteen, sixty. This is sixty, and I close it. And this dimension, and and this one, both are constant. Thirty meter. And now I will draw a circle between this, and the radius of this is fifteen radius, and thirty is the da. So click thirty, thirty diameter. Only one thing is remain: the distance seventy, the center of the circle from the origin. This gap is seventy millimeter. <coughs> and this one, just press and drag it. I take this 35 because this dimension doesn't matter. It uh, unite with the previous body, so it will merge in the first body. So this is our sketch, and now finish it. One circle is remaining. So select circle, and 12 is the diameter. 12. <coughs> Circle, center, and twelve is the diameter. And finish it. Now I will extrude it. Uh, half of thirty-six means eighteen. Or you can do symmetric value and click OK. It will merge automatically. You can see here. 
now the cut is remain <coughs> for this cut we will start from the top it will more easier click rectangle and click and this and the middle both are horizontally aligned and the gap is 36 minus 20 means 16 this gap is 16 and this is 45 this gap is 45 so I click this and this gap sorry I choose wrong this and this this will be between these two columns 45 I can click finish it and this dimension doesn't matter it must be some extra from the object now choose the extrude command and reverse the direction so that it will cut the this this body and now subtract and click ok and hide the sketch now it's turn to create a rib so select sketch and the front plane a draw a line from this to this now dimension it this is a 35 and the horizontal gap is 95 and finish this now select rip command rip this and let me check some let me check out first problem is this the sketch is something like this okay and we have drawn only straight value so double click and now draw a line okay and this convert reference and this gap is 50 <coughs> sorry this is 15 and click now finish it and I'll choose the rib let me check it out so rib is not working on this profile so I choose cancel and double click this one and make it close and dimension dimensional properly just exit and extrude this this symmetric value of 3 and click ok select the none because this surface is not coming inside the body now it's okay click again select extrude this curve and subtract this one these two so a desired shape will come now this is 45 millimeter far from the side plane so click and draw a datum plane great I created a datum plane 45 millimeter far from the side plane. 
center of these two circle is the same so select circle and the radius is 24 and 35 the first I draw two circle center and the diameter is 70 and second is 48 now click a line just make consonant and trim what you don't want now close this and distance is from the middle and this one also 120 the total is 120 now I am going to offset this this curve and this this is okay no. okay no problem just click and I am deselecting this curve and the offset distance is 10 and click okay now match this line so that it make a complete close sketch now finish this now I'm going to extrude this in reverse direction and the dimension is 45 total 70 so just type 70 here it is huh? it is 70 millimeter far from the sketch now go to edge blend and the radius is 15 this 15 and this one also 15 this is 15 and the last this one is also 15 hide the sketch hide the plane only holes are remain so I go I will go with the whole command and the four holes of 10 diameter select the point and one more point click this point is constant with this or finish this diameter is 10 and click ok now mirror this So this is our part, so how this will look.